I love a pretty lamp. And this is just one of my many Goodwill finds that I've had for maybe about a year now. And when I purchased it, I paid, I think maybe about $10, maybe about $10 for this lamp. And yes, it is sitting on top of my refrigerator. I mean, like who does that? I do. <laughs> But because it's sitting so high, you can't help but see under the lampshade. So since you can see under the lampshade, it's like every day I go in the refrigerator and I look up, I think, you know, that could be even prettier. So that's what we're getting ready to do. I will show you how I can make the underside of this lampshade pretty. So let's get started. The only supplies that I needed to purchase for this project was the gold glitter and the Mod Podge. And this time I'm using the Gloss Mod Podge. The Mod Podge was $6.97 and the gold glitter was only $2.47, both of which were purchased at Walmart. I put down a piece of black tissue paper to catch the excess glitter once I start sprinkling the glitter on the inside of the lampshade. I poured the Mod Podge in a little simple styrofoam bowl and I'm using just a foam brush to apply the Mod Podge. And you can purchase these little brushes. I think they come in a bag of several, and they are several different sizes, even at the dollar store. But I'm being very liberal with the Mod Podge. And I'll also be very liberal with the glitter because you want every inch of the inside of the lampshade covered in glitter. After I applied the first layer of Mod Podge and glitter, I did notice when I turned on the lampshade that I needed one more coat. There were certain areas that weren't covered quite as well as others, so to make sure I had an even coat after I finished the first coat and it totally dried, I went back and added a second coat of the Mod Podge and the glitter and that gave me the total coverage that I needed. This project was very very simple and the results turned out really nice. Thank you so much for watching. I already look forward to you joining me again next time.